keep getting the network discovery is turned off error. It might be hard for you to share files with other network computers or print documents in this video. We'll show you some ways to fix this problem. Most of Restarting your computer is a simple way to fix problems. Restarting your computer will fix small, temporary problems, clear the memory, and stop random memory leaks. The quick reboot is another good way to fix problems with the network. But if restarting the computer doesn't help, move on to the next steps in this video. In Windows 10 and 11, there are two network profiles, public and private. Windows will use the public profile for you by default because it's safer. But if you have the public network profile, other computers in your network won't be able to see your computer. But if you are in a trusted home or office network where file sharing is important, you should change the network profile to private. Here's what you need to do. Press the start button and type in control panel and open control panel app in the control panel app. Select Network and Sharing Center. Open Network and Sharing Center. Click the Change Advanced Sharing Settings. In the Change Advanced Sharing Settings window, you should see your current network profile private. Network Discovery Options and File and Printer Sharing Options. Make sure to turn on the options for both Turn on Network Discovery and File and Printer Sharing. Expand the Private Current Profile menu from Network Discovery. Select the Turn on Network Discovery and Turn on Automatic Setup of Network Connected Devices Options from File and Printer Sharing. Select the Turn on File and Printer Sharing option. Click the Save Changes button. Most people can fix the network discovery is turned off problem by switching from public to private. Make sure to check the problem to see if the steps earlier fixed it. Early in your troubleshooting, you should let the system figure out what's wrong on its own. If a quick restart of your PC and changing the network profile by hand don't work, use your Windows PC's troubleshooter to see if that helps. What you have to do is right click the start button, select settings, select update and security, select troubleshoot, click on the troubleshooters under the other section. Click the run button for network adapter. Wait for the system to finish troubleshooting the issue. You should also make sure to run the troubleshooter for shared folders. If network discovery is still not working. You should check to see if the services that are related to network discovery have been turned off. The DNS client, function discovery resource publication, SSDP discovery and UPnP device host are all services that are linked to each other. You'll need to go to the services menu and check each of these services one at a time. What you need to do, press the start button on your keyboard and type services. Open the services app, find the DNS client in the list of services, right? Click on DNS client and select properties in the pro properties window. Check the services status. It should say running and not anything else. Then check the startup type. It should say automatic. Click OK. Check the rest of the dependency services by repeating the steps earlier. For some people, the main cause of this problem is that their security software, like an antivirus, is not set up right. You can try turning off your antivirus or other security software to see if that's the case. Network adapters don't need updates very often, and Windows updates usually gives them the updates they need. But if nothing has worked so far, you should now check to see if you need to manually update your network adapter drivers. What you have to do is press Windows key plus R on your keyboard to open Run dialog box. At Run box, Type devngnt.msc and hit enter or click OK to open device manager. Click to expand network adapters. Right click on network adapter and then click update driver from the drop down menu. Click the option browse my computer for driver software. Click let me pick from a list of device drivers on my computer. Click next tab. Windows will now update and install the latest network driver. Wait for it to complete. After update process is complete, click close. Exit the device manager window. Reset. your computer.
computer's network settings is another good way to fix network discovery problems when you reset your network. All network adapters will be reinstalled, your Wi-Fi settings will be deleted, and your network settings will be set back to their defaults. Here's what you do. On your keyboard, press the Windows key plus I to open settings. Go to Network and Internet. Select advanced network settings. Select network reset. Click the reset now button. Afterwards, reboot your PC and check if network discovery is now functional. If you're Windows Defender Firewall is stopping it. Network discovery might not work. Follow these steps to turn off your firewall for a short time so you can. Click the start button then select on settings. Click on Privacy and Security. Click on Windows Security. Click on Open Windows Security button. Click on Firewall and Network Protection. Turn off your Windows Defender Firewall for all three networks, the main network, private network, and public network. That's it. If you think that this video is helpful, we would appreciate it if you can leave a like, subscribe to our channel, or share this video to your friends. This can greatly help in making sure that Google's algorithm can find and recommend this video to others.